good. Yeah. I'm Dan Paredes with uh, Akito Entertainment. Akito Entertainment. Akito. Oh, you could say that. Akito Game. Okay. Um, and I'm talking with Dimitri and sorry. Aurelian. Aurelian. Oh, yeah, that's a win name. Aurelian. No, that's a win name. Aurelian. Aurelian. Where are you guys from? Paris. Paris. Oh, okay. You yeah. can say that because of the bad English. Ah. Uh, uh. <laughs> well, your English is better than my French. Ah, uh, that's very kind to you. <laughs> so what's uh, what's this game? What's this game that we're looking at? Uh, ah, yeah, it's called uh, Kurd versus the uh, the Curse Kitty, and that's a weird name and that's a weird game too. Okay. Uh, it's all about skills and you have to protect uh, a, a cat in the center of the, of the level and you can uh, pick weapons, you can jump, jump on the enemies, uh, build some turrets so it's all about skills and strategy. The game is cute but uh, don't uh, let this fool you. That, that's oh, pretty hard, hard. Yeah, yeah, it's super hard. Picture it like uh, you, you remember the very old uh, Mario Bros. in, Arca in arcade. Yes, the original, yeah, not the super. Old, yeah, yes. yeah, with no scrolling and all. Yeah, yeah. So picture this, but like super, 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 super hard. Wow. Okay. So you're saying that you can build turrets and yep. things like that. So um, what do the turrets do? Just kind of help you fight all the all the. Yeah, it's it's the... uh, it helps to uh, to defend yourself. And uh, you can uh, build some uh, electric uh, electric tur turrets, uh, some uh, saws on the on the ground. But uh, be careful because everything in the in the game can be dangerous for the enemies and for you too. Oh, it can attack so, you. So yeah, okay. yeah, uh, the the saws uh, the saws especially. And um, wow, there's a lot of go there's a lot going on here. Yeah, yeah. and uh, the fun stuff is you can cancel any weapon and uh, transform it in, uh, how to say it politely, in uh, a dog presence. <laughs> okay. uh, so it will uh, slow the enemies and uh, yeah, you can uh, use it to get rid of them. Okay, so you, you, mentioned, uh, you mentioned Mario Brothers, What's the, what else, what other things have influenced this game? Um, like, where's, where's the idea Yeah, it's, uh, it's quite a mix between Mario Brothers and uh, Tower Defense and Super, 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 great box. Box. super Great Box, yeah, is a big influence on yeah, the game. Yeah. So that's pretty much it, yeah. Yep. Wow, okay. So how far along is the, is, is the game? Like, it, um, looks, it looks fantastic it's, right now. You know, there's half of the game is like just uh, to progress in the game. So you have a mission system where you unlock new stuff, new uh, enemies, new weapons, new abilities. So like a uh, rolling and the, attack. And the, the level gets bigger and yeah, bigger. Yeah, the, so. the level gets big, bigger and bigger. And so you have new enemies coming from everywhere. So you get tougher and tougher. Wow. Okay. And at, when you unlock everything, it's more like a score-based a score game. So you have yeah. to make the biggest score and, you know, top the, top the leaderboard. So how many levels are we talking about? Like a Super Meat Boy, hundreds of levels and kind of uh, thing going on? Uh, actually, yeah. be ready. OK. There is only one. Yeah, it's only one, one level. Yeah, only one, one but one it, it evolves. Oh, like it. Okay. It, it evolves uh, and uh, get bigger and bigger. Oh. So the the bigger the level is, uh, the more uh, type of enemies uh, will uh, randomly spawn. So it gets bigger, like it spreads out. Yeah, on then... top and on the on, oh, on the left okay. and right. Okay. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. So you can cool. learn the game, like uh, yeah, you can master the game at a very high level, be just because of that. Wow. Okay. So is this coming? Just is this only coming on Steam? Is this going on any console? It's on Steam already. It's on Steam already. Okay. Yeah. Okay. And yeah. PC, Mac, Linux. Uh, yeah. And for other platform, it's something we have in mind, but we don't know already if it will be released on console. It's something we have in mind, but we don't know exactly. Uh, yeah, because the, the the game is a bit popular in uh, Europe, but okay. here nobody cares about. And so, nobody knows about it. Yeah, nobody That's knows about it. Yeah, so I, this we are, first time I saw this. Yeah, and it, uh, it's out uh, November. Yeah, it was out so, in November. Oh, yeah. yeah, so we're very, very glad to have uh, won the Pakistan election. Yeah. yeah, because we get some exposure, exposure with that. Yes. And hopefully it will be uh, okay now to uh, do some console port and this kind of stuff. Thanks, thanks to that exposure. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Yeah, we'd love to see to see the game on other console, maybe uh, on, on Vita. Oh uh, yeah, on Vita it would on be Vita perfect. Would be awesome, Vita, yeah, I guess. that would yeah. be right right up there. Yeah. yeah, we like we like these smaller independent games. I mean we play everything, like everybody else plays everything, but like we like the smaller smaller type of games too and everything like that. Very cool. What well, um everybody that I talk to I always I always uh, ask, you know, what's your gaming origin? Meaning like, you know, what's what's the games that you first started playing? Like how did you first start playing? Did you were you PC? Were you on the Nintendo? I Mega Drive? I started yeah, I on Nintendo. Nintendo. Yeah, Nintendo. My very first game for, I think it was Mario. Super Mario. Mario. Yeah, okay. Super Mario. Yeah, yeah. So. And, so, yeah. and myself, I, I, I grown up with um, uh, very unperfect games 
and that's the kind of games I love. Uh, I love the match. The kind of broken games, but with a lot of uh, a strong personality. And okay. so maybe uh, like it's what? What do you, what do you uh, random uh, Ninja Gaiden spin-off, mm -hmm. uh, uh, Gargoyle Quest on Game Boy. Uh, this this kind of games where a lot. I don't know of if I'd say Gargoyle Quest is broken. Uh, the second one on NES. Okay. Gargoyle okay. Quest 2 is very broken, okay. but I love this anyway. Yeah, yeah, and yeah. So, that's a type of game uh, we were making at, uh, at Arkido. Some, mm -hmm. Something with a lot of personality, and if you don't like it, that's okay. But yeah, we yeah. try to uh, yeah, push the personality of the game and try something a bit different. Yeah, I, I like it. I, I like how you're describing it. We'll, we'll talk to our, our buddy, but he seems like he's really into it. So Yeah, and uh, <laughs> he, play, he played the game very well, so yeah, it's yeah. nice oh, to watch okay. him. Yeah, because it's not the very beginning of the game, so it's a bit tougher to to end all at first because you don't have the tutorial and anything when you play on on this version, and it's doing well because yeah, it seems okay. to yeah because was, lots of people die very fast because uh, yeah. it's pretty tough. Yeah, most most of the time you play like for uh, fifty uh, between fifty second, uh, fifteen seconds, seconds and one minute. Oh. So yeah. So you try again and again and again and again. Yeah, 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 yeah. Wow, and okay. he's playing for like four minutes now. Yeah. So the, the guy is good. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Hey, John, you're doing pretty good. <laughs> I hate you. Nah. Nah. No, you it's just to, too focused. You have to uh, focus. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I like it. I like it. So, um, yeah. This is your guys' first time in uh, in Seattle. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Very yeah. first time. Yeah. First time at PAX. First time yeah. in fact. Yeah, two weeks ago at, uh, I was at uh, Gamescom for another game, but Gamescom, yeah. yeah, but it, that's the very first time here, and that's really nice. Yeah, I, I like um, it's more peaceful than uh, the Gamescom because uh, I would think Gamescom is kind of crazy. Yeah, crazy. Uh, yeah, it's it's so over people and and the like noise. Yeah. Uh, mm. It's like uh, ten times uh, louder really? that that yeah, yeah. you you can talk actually. You can talk everywhere. At, at everywhere. <laughs> yeah. Boo, boo. Well, have you guys been into the main expo hall? That gets yeah, I, 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 I was just, I was just talking uh, talking with friends in the main hall, mm. and for real, this is like quiet uh, compared <laughs> to the Gamescom one. Well, it's cool. Yeah, it's really. Cool. At, at Gamescom, some uh, some had a, a microphone and speakers to be able to speak with a very uh, close friends. Yeah, that, yeah, that's yeah. just crazy. Yeah, we uh, we're we're. Um, we're local up here in yeah. Seattle, so yeah. this, is what, this is the convention we go to. Yeah, like you don't it. have to travel <laughs> to Germany. Yeah. Well, you know, I mean, America's really large, so it's very hard to travel from yeah. one place yeah. to another. I mean, I've been to Europe a couple of times, France to Germany, man, that's not that far. You take a couple of trains. Yeah. Yeah, you guys' trains are super fast. Yeah. Okay. I'm getting ama amazed by his skills. Oh, wow. 28,000. Yeah. Uh, just, just at the moment you say that. <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry. Yeah. Well, thanks guys for uh, talking thanks talking with us ah, about the yeah, very, very nice. cool. Thanks for your time. Yeah, thanks.